music sounds a little mellow after that ba brass. Oh, man. <laughs> Rocking and rolling. It's 9 a.m. this Wednesday morning. I'm Julie. And good morning. <laughs> I'm Greg. Well, you just heard the no BS brass in now band leader Reggie Excuse me. Pace is um, yeah. Join Reggie. Yeah. Yeah. Circus is no, in town. That's no BS either. <laughs> Um, uh, hey, Reggie, they're welcome. They're up to something. We're going to have to find yeah, out what they're up to. They're not part let's, of the band, are they? Chat with I wish they were. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna, we'll, we'll explain a little bit later. But uh, Reggie, thanks. But you guys got a great sound. Thank you. Totally. Thank you very much. Welcome back. Thank you. Tell That's us great. how you guys got together. Mm -hmm. uh, we met each other uh, through the days at VCU and um, playing in different jazz groups and rock groups in town in, in Richmond, like a little small musical community. What's it like? Do you guys get, like, for me, I don't think I've, I've seen a group like yours perform live before. So when you guys started, I mean, I was just feeling it. We were dancing over here. It's, it's just a, an awesome sound. But you well, guys are you. used to it because, yeah. you know, you play brass. I mean, that's what you do. That's what we do. <laughs> we bring the excitement. And that's, you know, a big thing about No BS Brass Band, trying to, like, bring that voice to the Richmond music community. Yeah, tell it's, us who you sound like. I mean, who are you influenced In the world. <laughs> Uh, we're influenced by like some classic rock and then like classic funk, like you know Tower of Power, and then the brass bands of like Soul Rebels and you know Dirty Dozen and stuff like that. And then mostly Richmond. We just write our own stuff. So you write your own and you play some your own twist on some favorites. And oh stuff, yeah, right? on some covers just for fun. Yeah. You know. Now you guys uh, sort of met through the whole VCU community. Is mm -hmm. that uh, tell us how you guys just the whole thing germinated. Where, where did that come from? We hang out yeah. on Thursdays, right? Yeah. Right. Well, we have rehearsals at uh, Drummer's House every Thursday. A lot of us met in the VCU music department. Uh, a lot of us are music majors and like alumni of VCU and jazz band and stuff like that. And then playing in the Oregon Hill Funk All Stars and Devil's Workshop and stuff like that. And we all met each other. Let's talk about what you, you guys have a benefit coming up. What's it all about and how uh, can folks? This Friday at uh, Canal Club, there's a benefit called Benefest. And there's bands playing from about 6 o'clock till 1 in the morning. And it's a benefit for uh, raising money for children that want to play in bands and stuff and can't afford to rent instruments and things like that. Oh, that's great. Tell us about, uh, Reggie, when you finally get up on the stage like that. I mean, tell us about the energy and the electricity that, uh, that you guys give off. Uh, nothing can beat it. Novi Express, man, sweetest band in the world. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> We're going to, you know, be all over the place pretty soon, and I'm pretty excited to be here from Richmond. Yeah, tell us, what, I mean, where do you want to see this band go? Mm -hmm. uh, my, one of my biggest goals is to play the Super Bowl. All so, right. Yeah, nice. I support that. <laughs> that's, yeah. a, that's a big crowd. Travel that's the a, world, yeah. play the Super Bowl. How about you when you guys are raising money to help bring music to children, did all of you, um, were you drawn to music as children, or was this something that you developed later in life? Uh, I'm, in I'm sure every one of us was started as a kid. I know I started in sixth grade or something. Had a, a middle school band director that uh -huh. made me want to do it forever. You know? Oh, that's so, amazing. Played the seed in the young minds. Yeah, that's and all it. of us teach lessons and things, so we're all pretty close to like, the children and stuff. Tell us, you have vocals as well, Reggie, or is it pretty much instrumental? Pretty much instrumental on the first album. The next one we're doing, working on is going to have a lot more vocals, and we have some vocals in some tunes. Do you? Yeah. And how often do you guys, you practice once a week. I know you mm -hmm. probably all have day jobs. How often do you guys end up out performing? And uh, uh, We perform, um, I would say, somewhere close to about once a week, but mm -hmm. not quite, you know. Uh, we try to spread it out so people don't get sick of us. Yeah. yeah. How they many won. members in the band? About 10. About 10. So yeah. we kind of give or take yeah. a few. Whoever <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> is available, yeah. right? Yeah. Well, I love it. I can't remember. You know, we have a lot of live acts in here, but the sound just fills the studio. And it's, I'm sure there are a lot of people in there in the newsroom like, what is going on <laughs> out there? No need of espresso. We're just yeah. getting word that the, apparently the newsroom is really jamming. They're rocking. Great. Yeah. <laughs> so we appreciate it, man. Will Thank you guys you. play again for us a little later? We will. Good Excellent. stuff. Well, we can't wait. The no BS BS. <laughs> no, <laughs> the BS. no BS. Love brass. Love it. Hey, Reggie, thank you so much, man. Thank you for having Certainly me. Certainly no BS. Appreciate it, man. All right, good stuff. Hey,